Welcome to Fathers on Fire. I'm Austin Barnett, and I'm here with Pastor Mark Cushing from our Niagara Falls campus. Mark, how are we doing today? Doing pretty well. We're ready, uh, ready for some wings. Yeah, I'm glad you are. I have, fi- <laughs> I have five in line for us. I, so I only see four here. Yeah, well, we're gonna call them the Death Wing later. I, we have water, ice, milk, Pepto, ice cream, and then this is some sort of um, blue cheese, if you'd like. Uh, I can start you off with something now where we can get started on our first wing. Well, is this American milk? That's American milk. I do prefer my Canadian milk in a bag. Oh, I didn't know Canadians have milk in bags. Yeah. Oh, yeah. You That's still that. a thing up there. You didn't know that. Yeah, I didn't. I brought some. I brought some. You like, did? Somebody have some here? Oh, yeah. oh, yeah. I got some. Got some milk in a bag here. Check it out. That's cool. That's one liter of milk right there. Do you guys also use it as pillows? <laughs> yeah, or, I mean, like if you have to ice your shoulder, like I mean, you that's can. actually pretty nice. Yeah, you gotta. I'll, I'll share Canadian milk with you. You want some Canadian milk? Yeah, we got something to open it. Teeth? Well, or scissors. Yeah, oh, that's better. <laughs> cheers. Oh, cheers. Yeah, let's have some to start us off. A little parched in. Mmm. <sighs> tastes a lot different out of a bag. Doesn't it? I taste the bag. It's quality. All right, first wing, mild, medium. Okay, let's do it. My wings are the same. These wings are from Duff's. I love Duff's. Do you like Duff's? Yep. What do you normally get when you get Duff's wings? I normally get a medium light. This is spicy for a mild medium. So medium light's even less hot than this. This is a hot, this is no. hotter than you normally would. No, medium light's the next, I think it's the next one. Medium and the medium light. Mm-hmm. Yep. Because they say that's hotter than it really is, whatever. Mm-hmm. You prefer drums or flats? Well, I didn't have a choice here. I only have four flats. <laughs> I only got four flats too. <laughs> <laughs> Who set this up? What if my if my preference is the drums, do I get those? I don't, I don't think it works like Canadian milk. You can't <laughs> okay. you can't just call it what you want. All right, that's fair. Well, I enjoy the flats actually. So we're celebrating Father's Day. Okay. How many kids you got, Mark? I have four children. Four adult children now. That's all. Oldest is? 25. Youngest is? 20. This is a quiz. That's yeah. correct. Yeah. <laughs> That's correct. <laughs> you got the answers. <laughs> mm-hmm. I like that. Yeah. I am. People might not know. You're you're a Canadian citizen. Yeah. Are you a, do- a dual citizen? I am not. Oh, you're just a Canadian. Yeah. Not just. I shouldn't say that. <laughs> you are Canadian. We love Canadian. I am fully Canadian. This looks kind of good. I keep coming back for it. I'm not going to lie. My mother was American. Yeah. Yeah. I didn't know that. Yeah. She was a... Uh, U.S. landed immigrant residing in Canada. So she actually couldn't vote in either country, mm. which is kind of interesting. But And yet she still did vote at times and until they caught her. <laughs> wow. Okay, medium yeah. hot. You ready to move on? Yeah, let's do it. It is Father's Day. Medium hot. <clears throat> Tell me, one, how, how are you feeling? I'm okay right now. Okay. What's the best part about being a dad? Now that you got grown kids, it could be anything when they're kids or as they've getting old, gotten older, best part about being a dad. Is it Jonah, now you have a golf partner? I know you and Jonah like to golf. Mark is the is one of the best golfers I know, by the no, way. No, well, it's not. He won't tell you that, but yeah. short game, everything. Tell me something else. Uh, the, I think my favorite part about being a dad is just being with my kids. Like, um, Kathy and I have both said, but I'll say it as a dad, I've loved every stage of life so far with them and just being around them. And I love the fact that I hope this doesn't change that my kids don't mind hanging around with me. And uh, so I'm gonna do everything I can to keep that going because I love hanging around them. So I think that's my, just being together. Those are my best times when we're, we have something in our house and I never thought I'd own a hot tub, but we have, we have hot tub huddles at our house where our, our whole family goes in the hot tub. A holy hot tub huddle. Yeah, well, I don't, I, no, it's not holy, really, uh, at all. <laughs> That's six people uh, in a hot tub. Yeah, but it's... How does that uh, work? Like, water displacement must be off the charts. Yeah. All right, let's move on to hot. <clears throat> okay. Now that things are getting a little spicy, I'm going to bring up some things that might be a little, you know, uncomfortable. We don't, I, know, I know we don't talk about this a lot, but um, as you take your first bite... I am sweating. You do feel, yeah, you just said you were fine, but you are feeling it. No, but I'm starting to, you know, when you get- Wait till you get to hot. When you get the glasses on and it starts to, the glass, when the glasses start I falling can, off my head, you're gonna know that I'm sweating. I can offer you some ice cream or I American know, milk. I, I thought it was sour cream when it first came out. Sorry? I will have some of that after though. All right, so this is the hot wing. Okay. Mark. What's spicy? I don't want to break the news to anybody. Oh yeah. But um, your name's not really Mark. <laughs> that was good. 
I've lived with that my whole life. With what? The fact that my name's not Mark. <laughs> yeah. Every, what? Um, every class I was in, you know. Everybody call you Mark, and then you did the role teacher. No, everybody called, everybody called me Robert. Ah. Robert Cushing. I don't think. <laughs> no, it's Mark. You know, I'm Robert Mark Cushing. Robert Mark or Robert Marcus? Robert Mark. Mark. My dad is Robert Marcus. Hmm. Well, he's actually Robert Marcus Carrillo Cushing. So you're not the second. I am not the second. No. So Robert Mark, but I go by Mark. Did you know Pastor Jerry's the second? I know. He's a junior. Uh, Shh, don't tell anybody. He's junior. Mm -hmm. Junior Jerry, what we call him. That's what you call him. I don't know. That's not what I call him. Was you didn't. I, you only took a little. Was, I know. I, I, sorry. You, you haven't eaten a lot of your wings. Well, you you asked me a question. Well, I thought we were here to eat yeah. wings, and you're here to like take a nibble. I feel like the, the mice have got. Can you show the Can you show the people? Sure. How much you've not yeah. eaten? But they're organized <laughs> over there. All right, we're moving to super hot as we do. I want to know an embarrassing moment or thing that you've done as a father. Oh, yeah. Embarrassing. Not as a father. That's tough when you're uh, when you're as cool as I am. It's tough. Yeah, you are pretty cool. <laughs> I'm just joking. <laughs> um, no, uh, let's see. Well, you know, I'm gonna eat I, my wing because the the whole purpose for today is to eat wings together. So I'm gonna eat my wing. You can eat it too. I know. I keep asking you questions. I know. It's, kind it's of hard weird. to eat and talk, isn't it? You can eat with my, a mouthful. My parents told me not to do that. No, no, no. Pastor Jerry with his mouth full the whole time. Oh, really? Yeah, yeah. yeah. See, he's better than. He, he listened to instructions, and I'm trying to obey my parents still. Okay, here we go. Is that your first bite of Super Hot? Yep. I'm just not going to talk so that you can actually have some of your wing. I, I, I got to be honest. Ooh, Super Hot's hot? Well, I'm, yes! I'm starting to feel it. He's ready. Because I hadn't felt it. But now, that sauce. That's a saucy wing. Usually when they're hotter, they're not as saucy. Is that a Canadian thing? I hate to always bring it back to Canada, but sometimes I do. All the time. You mean saucy Canadian? Yeah, like do Canadians have chicken wings, or do you call them buffalo wings? Do you call them like American <laughs> wings? American buffalo wings? Does Canada have chicken wings? You never answered. No, we don't. We you don't? don't? Have, we don't have chickens on our country. I knew it. Country. I knew it. It's only it's only beef. They don't let me over the border. So. Canadian beef started to get me. Is it harder to focus? I mean... I don't know how focused I am to begin with, but, but yeah, just the breathing. You can eat more if you like. breathing in. It's I breathe in through my nose. I'm not affected as much, except the fact that my lips are on fire. Are your, are your lips on fire? I think it tastes I, great. Well, they only gave me medium wings, so I don't know. Oh, <laughs> oh man. All right. All right, you ready for the death wing? I think the only way that we could do this is is uh, by singing the first verse of the national anthem. You're a singer. Well, you lead worship, yeah? I mean, yeah. I could, sing, right. I could sing in French for you if you want. I'll, you sing it in French, I'll sing it in American. We're not going to sing it, are we? are we? Yeah. Okay. Just the first little ditty. You okay. got a great voice. I'll sing maybe third, fifth harmony. <laughs> no, you're <laughs> Okay. Oh, Canada, our home and native land, true pain. Oh, it's hard to sing with someone who's singing in English or French. All thy sons. You want me singing in French? In all of us command. All of us command. We changed the wit lyrics. Just we a changed it? Years, what year was that? Years ago. Oh, sorry. Maybe five, six years ago. Oh, in no. all of us command. Because we can't say in all thy sons. I'm going to get rid of my bones because I actually ate my wings. Oh. But. Yeah. Okay. okay. Look at that. Well, I ate most of it. All right, let's get to this right. death wing. Do, does somebody have to bring it to us? Or do we, do we go get it? <laughs> Someone brought oh. it. It's right next to you. Man. Magic. While we were singing the anthem, they weren't walking during the anthem. I told you, day. if you sing the anthem, that's what brings the death wing. And the death wing was brought, and you didn't even know. I didn't. I didn't, because it, they shouldn't have been walking during the anthem. <laughs> it's true. These are Duff's wings. Or, <laughs> these are Duff's bowls. The, oh, are they? Yeah. yeah. I always like these. And the wing. All right, death wing. Okay. I gotta keep it off the lips. What do you think about it? You did pretty you well on it. You look great too. Is it building? It's building. There it is. Yeah. The milk is coming. Oh, yeah. I don't know that I love the, the death one. That is a death one. Oh, 
<laughs> Wait. No, you're making this a... interview really hard, you know? Obviously, I'm not following. Oh, yeah, that's right. You're not following four. the rules. We had you four. know where we are. Oh, okay. Maybe it's just a hotness. Wow. You see. are sweating under your eye holes. I can see it now. Push your glasses up, guy. Don't touch your eyes. Oh, it's starting to I think if I breathe, I'm in trouble. Well, I'm gonna need you to breathe. <laughs> it's very hot. I'd like you to give some advice to fathers out there. It is Father's Day, and they need to know. <laughs> they need to know, Mark or Robert. <laughs> I don't feel good. That's the worst. Ew. <laughs> That's disgusting. What? It's Why? Cold. It's cold. <coughs> That's good. <coughs> I need to do that. I need more milk water. That's okay. I think I'm good. Okay, sure. All right. All right. Give advice to dad. Or give some advice to... Give it, If you would, could give advice to dads, what would it be? Probably stay away from the death wing. I think I have acid reflux already. You know, uh, it was uh, 17, 17 years ago or so that uh, my father-in-law passed away and uh, my kids are Opa, so they never really got to know him very well. But one thing I remember, and it kind of makes me a little emotional, um, it's not just the sauce. Um, whenever he came over to our house, he, the world stopped for him. He, he didn't care about anything else. He just went down on, on one knee and my kids would just run to him. And uh, I wanted to be more like that. And being a task guy, I fought that all the time, you know, because I, I got to get the lawn cut and they can, they know that dad's got work to do and I can pause and, but, don't miss those opportunities to just be a dad and forget about all the other stuff. Um, because it, it speaks not only to your kids, but it speaks to everybody else too. But yeah, don't miss those opportunities to quote unquote unplug and just be there and be all in with where your kids are at. So I guess that's, that would be the biggest thing that I would say. Well, for what it's worth, I think you've done and continue to do a great job as a dad. Oh, well, thank you. So, here's milk water nice. cheers to you. <laughs> yeah, milk water. You fathers. I never, I don't even like drinking what it looks like this, but you know, nope. I don't even care. Well, happy Father's Day to you and to all the dads out there. Happy Father's Day. This has been Fathers on Fire. <laughs>